Hi, in this video I'm going to have a look at the third day of the Alchemy Shop event. Uh, today's stages are Troop Training, uh, Lucky Shot and Artifact Collector. I'm not going to do anything with the artifacts, don't have enough uh, items to, to do that. I'm going to focus on the Lucky Shot and Troop Training first. Uh, I'm going to have a look at the Troop Training. Actually didn't prepare well, so let's... Uh, uh, make myself ready training capacity increase always nice other training capacity increase so that's it for the equipment my talents the balance focused setup Heroes, always two heroes that I'm using still the uh, LOS because I don't have, I haven't maxed Evane the Bestower yet and Lady Isabel for a bit additional training capacity. Okay, uh, temporary a relic luckily we have this for cheap not going to do that much training but i th think it's still worthwhile to have the training scepter fortunately we didn't hold on to our own avalon this past king of first kingdom so i don't have any additional uh, boosts from the kingdom uh, i actually don't plan to do much if we look at the so I think the, yeah, I'm going to try to get to the 70,000 and that's uh, that's it. So let's, uh, yeah, and the first step I'm going to do is actually uh, speed up this one and I'm only going to focus on the, on the stables actually. And I think I should train around 40k, so only on the, on the cavalry, say stables, but uh, cavalry, okay can first before having to activate the temporary boost can first complete this one and now we can really get started population search and the extra 10 percent quick training it's actually the first time that i do training that i have my uh, training grounds at uh, level 46 so that was an extra uh, training capacity and uh, uh, five percent troop training speed boost so that's also nice uh, how much do i have in here five so let's do seven of these and see where i'm at but it's really a pity to not to, to speed train without a 300 percent you just see how expensive it is from a uh, speed ups point of view. Two. Three. Four. five six seven mm, I think we should be close but not yet past the point I wanted to achieve but uh, let's see Uh, so we do a bit more training. Mm. 
I'm not exactly sure. Let's do something like this and see. Hopefully we just passed it by a small margin. If not, I have to do some... Uh, we passed it nice. And then we start a normal daily batch. ones as well okay um, that is that is that so now I can set this one back always important and the rest I will do later I'm just curious because I didn't really look at that, like what is in the shop. Ah, that's nice. We can purchase some, uh, it's not a lot, but definitely those dragon flame orbs. I want to purchase them anyway, so if I can purchase them here with a discount, that is what I'm going to do. I kind of hoped it was the case, but I forgot to check before I started. But this is what makes it uh, extra worthwhile to go to the uh, yeah the first uh, marker to unlock this uh, this one. Okay, uh, now let's look at the lucky shot. Actually, you have a couple of things I want to want to do. And first I'm going to go to the hero weapons. Oh, that something went wrong. Hero weapons and refresh. I think it accidentally went to start. I have that more often. And for the hero weapons, I just want to have the tiers of ascension. That's the main uh, thing. Um, and I would like to have about 2.4 million. Let's see if I can do that within 12 shots. Just have to check because actually we have as the second one we have the third um, from a size wise the third reward so better to stop now so we have 560 will be a bit difficult for me to remember everything okay reset targets So this is um, 1.26 plus 3.8, 1.64 plus 5.6. So I have to have a little bit more, probably uh, two shots will do it. If I have done my calculations correct. Yeah, let's hope so. Uh, definitely with this one, a bit lucky again. So that's good. Um, so that was a total of 
12 plus uh, 6 is 18 then I have 32 left because I want to go for um, 50 coins and that is good the rest I want to focus on getting sun hearts actually for my uh, for the gemstones I realize I'm a bit low on those so now the main focus will just be to get the sun hearts as much as possible yay that's nice getting them on the second shot again can't be lucky each time I think I've done 12 so far Twenty four. Yeah, I just go for another one. I think I already have enough, but uh, just want to go for another round. Okay, and now I think I'm close, but not yet past the 50. No, the last two I will just go for tears of ascension. Without glory fragments as the third reward. It is a bit. I don't know if it was worth it to spend so many clicks on it because I just want to get the first one twice. Okay. Well, then we can claim a bit here. And uh, yeah, that is it for today's stages. I already prepared a bit with uh, transferring some resources for the building and upgrade, uh, sorry, the upgrade and research uh, stage. Plan to upgrade my university, still have to transfer the food, I will do that later because uh, I'm still going to participate in the Ultimate Alliance Conquest and uh, don't want to burn the food. Want to upgrade the university. And probably I'm going to do my first Deadly Storm research at that time after upgrading the university and a bit more uh, of the King's Legion. Deadly Storm, very expensive. The new uh, sense of time ingredients, very hard to come by and you still have to use quite a lot of Philosopher's Stones as well. So, But... It, I'm just looking at the amount of uh, Philosopher's Stones I'm using to get rewards, so why not uh, do it? I have the sense of time to just do one project, so that's fine. I can do it now. Uh, I mean now, next Tuesday, when the stage is active. Okay, well, that was it for today. If you have any comments or any questions, that is always much appreciated, and thanks for watching this video.